Welcome to howtocookgreatfood.com. Hello, today we're going to be making some um, sesame fried bananas. Very simple, very quick. So what we've got is, uh, I've got some bananas obviously. They're not overripe, they're slightly just under in fact. I've got some sesame seeds, I've got a large knob of butter, I've got some honey, I've got a little bit of uh, ginger powder, a little bit of nutmeg, and a little bit of cinnamon. Let's go over to the cooker and start these. Okay, so I've got a decent non-stick medium-sized pan here. We need to get this butter in. Keep it nice and low. Keep it. I don't want this to uh, burn. So we need to gently, gently melt that. I'm going to go and peel some bananas. See you in a moment. Okay, so that's nicely melted. Now we're just going to add uh, our cinnamon, ginger paste and nutmeg in there. This will just really flavour that. That butter nicely. Now I've cut my bananas into this sort of shape and size. I mean you can cut them how you like to be honest. Um, you can cut them down the middle. You can do them whole in fact, so that's up to you. So I'm just doing mine like this. We've got to be fairly quick here. So now I'll just toss these around and let them fry. Not too long. We're going to do these for like a minute and then we're going to add some sesame seeds and some honey and then they'll be done. If you cook them too long, obviously they'll turn into a complete mush. That's why I suggested that you use fairly hard bananas. It doesn't have to be that hard, just not, not silly soft. Alright, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so we're back now. These are coming on very nicely. Now I'm just going to get some sesame seeds onto the bananas and into the flavoured butter. They'll all mix eventually. And these will toast as well in that butter. And while we're just here, I'm going to add some honey. Lots of people use sugar. I'm not a great fan of, of putting sugar in here. I'm going straight from the honey. So just turn these around. Turn them over. I mean, we're, we're 30 seconds away from these being done. You have to be careful that you don't burn the, the butter. That would be a disaster on this dish, so. And the butter mixed with the honey will sort of create a toffee. And when they get cold, if you leave them to get cold, they will be absolutely solid like toffee. Okay, heat off, we're done. Okay, here we are then. Fantastic, very simple dish to make. They're really delicious. I've just served these with some single cream and a little bit of a sliced mango. So we'll see you again next time. Take care, bye-bye. HowToCookGreatFood.com Don't forget to subscribe to our channel.